morning. This is an episode of the Hadley Report and it's an occasional production of Hadley Media. Today is November 4th, 2019 and I am David Nixon, the town administrator. Last time we had a Hadley Report we talked about the, bond, the town's bond rating upgrade from AA plus to AAA, the highest possible rating. And one of the driving features of our upgrade was something called OPEB, O-P-E-B, which stands for Other Post-Employment Benefits. All right. In the near future, uh, you're going to be hearing more and more about OPEB costs, and it's going to be presented in terms of either a growing crisis or as a term as a term associated with debate and friction and town uh, officials. I am pleased to report that Hadley is managing its OPEB obligations and at present we are way ahead of other cities and towns in the Commonwealth in terms of managing these obligations in a responsible, sustainable and effective manner. So what the heck is OPEB? OPEB is as I said, stands for Other Post-Employment Benefits. It's an accounting liability that applies to every governmental unit in the nation, all cities and towns, all states and counties, all territories, reservations, possessions, and other districts. What does OPEB mean? Think about it this way. When somebody retires, they get a pension. That pension is administered by the retirement board. In this case, for the town of Hadley, it would be the Hampshire Retirement uh, Commission. But each retiree is also eligible to get other benefits other than pensions. These are health insurance, life insurance, and dental insurance. These costs are uh, handled by each town and city and district. That's what OPEB is, is the difference between what we're paying now and what our future costs are for life insurance, health insurance, and dental insurance. For Hadley, well, let's back up a little bit. The total low OPEB, OPEB liability is uh, projected in the future by asking a hypothetical question. How much in future costs would a town have to pay if all of its eligible employees retired on June 30th of any one year. All right, so this is a projection forward of future costs that are estimated using actuarial tables. For Hadley, that number is currently $7.6 million. That's our total unfunded liability for health insurance and life insurance. We do not offer dental insurance, so that's no longer a consideration. Um, it's important to understand that $7.6 million is a big number, it's enough to scare your pants off, but it is not an invoice that the town will receive. There's nobody going to show up and say, where's our money? Instead, um, in order to manage this unfunded liability, the town, if we were to do this as a pay-as-you-go basis, uh, we would uh, devote more and more of the budget to handling future costs of retirees who are a living longer there are more of them and health insurance costs continue to rise for them so we would begin in the future to strip resources away from other functions so say education public safety public works it does represent, uh, represent a challenge that needs to be addressed and the sooner the better now in hadley I'm pleased to report that Hadley recognized its OPEB obligations early and developed a funding plan which has been consistently followed uh, that is paying down the total liability and improving Hadley's image in the eyes of bond rating agencies. Starting in 2014, Hadley began aggressively upping its annual contribution to this unfunded liability until we reached a point where we surpassed uh, the $219,000 uh, break-even point. So we settled on a basis a little higher than that at $240,000 and decided that we were going to 
add to this amount annually by that number plus two and a half percent. Um, so now Hadley is paying down its obligation, increasing its rate on return on investments in this particular fund, and controlling future cost escalation, all within a payment plan that can be sustained by the tax base. We have funded 19 and a quarter percent of our obligation, uh, and our impact on the total tax base is sustainably less than 1% per year. Hadley is now ranked in the top 20th percentile of all cities and towns in the Commonwealth for managing its OPEB obligation. That means that 80% of the 351 towns in the Commonwealth were doing better than, than they are. So the news is good. We have a plan. We're following it. Um, the information that you're going to get in the future about OPEB and it being a crisis, we have that under control. And for further information, you can take a look at my budget book, uh, which is on my webpage at www.hadleyma.org. It's got a detailed explanation in there. Or you can call me at 413-586-0221.